Hello tribe, welcome back to my channel. So in case my eyes appear red on camera, I just came back from eyelash lamination. So just ignore it if you can. So today we're gonna be talking about rewards coming your way. This topic was voted for by patrons. I'm going to do an extension of this reading. If you want to find me on the other side, all links are down below. I would like to thank you all for liking my videos and engaging with my content. As you know, it helps the channel tremendously. And I'd like to say that once again, this video is sponsored by Keen. You probably heard about Keen, especially from me many times before. And if you have no idea what Keen is, Keen is a website where there are a lot of tarot readers, astrologers, mediums. I connected to one particular tarot reader to try their services. And I'd say he wasn't only a tarot reader, he was a channeler because of how quick he was responding to my questions. Another thing that is good about Keen is that there's always someone online 24 seven, and you can also choose either you're more comfortable with chat or call option. I know these days some people don't want to use the call option. I notice many people like to chat to one another instead of picking up the phone. If you'd like to use this opportunity and use their promotion right now, you can get 10 minutes for only $1.99, which is up to $99 of savings. To take advantage of this promotion, click the link down below. It's trykeen.com slash Brigitta. Instead of G, it's number nine. Thank you for listening and let's get back to the video. So today we're asking a question. What rewards are coming your way? This topic was voted for by patrons. Let's get to it. Pile number one is Super Lunaris Tarot on your left. Pile two in the middle is Texture Tarot. And pile three is the Golden Foil Tarot. Choose your Ace of Pentacles and I'll see you in timestamps. Hello group one, let's see what rewards are coming your way. Whoever has chosen the Super Lunaris deck. What rewards may you expect? Okay, these two cards want to come out. I'm going to pull from the mm -mm -mm, Steampunk Kipper as well. I'm gonna reveal all these cards in a minute. Rewards coming your way. And what is something that you've been doing in order to attract those rewards? What have you been doing in order to attract that? Let's see. We have the King of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, and Three of Cups. We have the courthouse as well as yearning and abroad. Mm -hmm. And we have the nine of swords as well as the temperance. Okay. <laughs> you know what rewards are coming your way? Um, rest rest rejuvenation as well as time off for a lot of you it feels like you're going to be experiencing the clarity of mind i'm getting if you've been stressed late lately if you've not been sleeping really well i'm seeing you being able to book a trip that you wanted to book for a while it could be somewhere in another country. You may be traveling to another country. You may be traveling to maybe another town. But you're taking some time off. Also, for some of you, what I'm seeing, any um, legal dealings that you are currently involved in, those will go great. Um, so there's nothing to worry about if you need to fill any forms, if, you like, if you're looking for approval, waiting for approval, if you're looking for an answer, a result of a test, it feels like you are rewarded for the hard work that you've been putting in. 
And for some of you, this is very connected to your finances. So you're getting um, enough enough resources come your way in order for you to be able to book a trip. Maybe you need to get a visa as well. Anything to do with formalities connected to trips, could be buying tickets, whatever the case. But you're able to rest and rejuvenate and come back into balance because you can travel somewhere or because you can book yourself in for a time off. And I'm not getting that it's going to be only for a couple of days, like a weekend getaway. I'm getting that you are traveling somewhere much further than you may imagine right now. Why are you getting these rewards? Because you've been very focused on your money. You are very focused on your work. You are focused on your money. You know how to manage it better. I'm saying better because for some of you, maybe it was a struggle in the past. And by managing it well, the more, the better relationship you have with your money, the better opportunities open up for you. I'm also seeing some of you helped someone in the past. This is good karma. Helped someone in the past. It would be a, a friend or a family member. Um, you may have given them something material or borrowed some money or helped them at a time when they needed it the most. And this is good karma coming your way. I'm seeing you going to a place that is very rejuvenating to your um, physical body as well as your energy body. You're able to relax. You're able to feel refreshed. Let's see what else. What rewards are coming your way? I'm seeing someone's skin improving. I know that's weird uh, what I'm picking up. Very random, but someone's overall mental state is much better than it was before. Um, there is no more stress. And that's going to show on the way you look. At that period of time that you're going to have for rejuvenation, rest is going to show on your face even. Mm -hmm. Some of you during that time will have a really good idea for business or an additional idea for existing business. Write those ideas down and it feels like it's, it's going to be happening around the time when you are resting. It's going to hit you out of nowhere. You go, oh my God, why don't I try this? Or I feel like that's what was missing in my business. And you're going to see a big opportunity that you will want to explore. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Queen of Wands is here. You're going to feel very passionate about that idea. You will want to jump in straight away. Let's get it done. Let's try this out. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, it's like you're not backing off. You're like, I'm going to do this regardless of how much time and energy this will require. Now I feel much lighter. Now I feel that my battery has been charged up. And therefore, I'm going to use that energy for the future. For your future endeavors that somehow is connected to your financial abundance mm -hmm. yeah your heart's singing whatever this idea is about your heart's gonna be singing you will want to tell someone about it you will want to share it with your family or chosen family like friends and um you get in support as well this could be something to do with online or with involving technology 
Yeah. You know what? For a lot of you, rewards are coming your way in a career sense. But the crucial time will be for you is taking time off. Taking time off first, that's when it feels like everything settles in your head. Um, you are much more grounded. Therefore, you can think more clearly. So do not rush through rest period. Do not rush. Just be present in it. It's going to give you so, so much. So much strength. So much energy. Clear-headedness. <laughs> That's the word. <laughs> and um, I'm seeing you becoming a boss or a really good leader of some sort of a project or a business. Or overall, you're going to, you're going to feel that you have everything under control when it comes to your finances. And more resources will be coming your way. I'm going to extend this reading on Patreon. So if you want to see me on the other side, thank you for checking out this reading and spending some time with me today. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Hello, group number two. Let's see what rewards are coming your way. Whoever has chosen the texture tarot. What rewards are coming your way? We have the Peony of Cups, we have the King of Wands, okay, we have the Four of Pentacles, we have the Two of Cups, mm-hmm, bottom of the deck we have the Emperor, quite a luxurious looking one, and I'm gonna be pulling from the Steampunk Kipper Tarot. rewards are coming your way we have young woman we have ending a loss reversed I like that for you I want to keep it reversed usually I have all my cards upright <laughs> this is gonna sound um, weird but i'm getting um gains gains now for some of you i am seeing that you are <laughs> you are the reward <laughs> it's the way you look it's the way you look is the energy that you radiate and with that energy, you can attract quite a lot your way. Now, you're going to have to make a decision around that time. It feels like a glow up of energy, a glow up um, in general, the way you dress, the way you present yourself. You are focusing much more on your worth because something that has happened in the past that made you feel like you lost either someone and you were grieving or you felt that you lost part of yourself or part of the life that you used to have and you don't have it anymore. Maybe you imagine that you, you're going to have a particular lifestyle or whatever the case, but it's, it, was, it wasn't there anymore and you had to find peace with it in some way. And maybe it took you some time to grieve to go through emotional roller coaster, but you are stepping up your game in this next chapter. You're going to take some time, right, to process your emotions, or you did already. And um, after that, you're going to seem slightly like a, new, a different person. Some people may even tell you that you look differently. You may want to change your style, you may want to change um, the way you think about yourself. Your self-confidence is growing here. And with that self-confidence, you are attracting quite a lot. Some of you are going to decide to focus that energy 
that you hold on your finances and attract financial abundance. Others of you will be focusing more on relationship, but I feel like it kind of goes hand in hand here because you get in new connections, you're feeling youthful. People can feel your energy, feeling charismatic, youthful, um, self-confident, and therefore people will be complimenting you. Um, some people may come back from the past wanting your attention. Take those as compliments, your cards are saying. They take those situations as compliments. People want to invest in you, invest their time, their energy in you. It's like um, people will want, uh, will want a piece of you. <laughs> Reminded me of that Britney song. You want a piece of me. <laughs> Maybe I give it a listen. There might be something there for you. Mm-hmm. Since we started talking about music, let me pull a card or two from this handmade deck. What rewards are coming your way? We have MB14 pyramids, but I am curious about what's coming after my last breath. Pyramids, temples, statues, and candles. Um, he's actually great. Probably um, some of you already know this person. Um, He's a beatboxer, he's a looper, and his music is great. Um, give it a listen. Lyrics of this song in general, Pyramids, very, very deep. It's like, and he's very ta talented, one of the most probably talented that I know of. Um, you're able, by your ability, by your skill or particular talent and charisma on top of that, you are being seen. And therefore, when you're focused on that energy and you direct it somewhere with intention, that's what I want to get. That's who I want to meet. You're able to get it pretty soon, pretty quickly. So I'm getting like manifestation skills. It's not uh, what rewards are coming your way. It's about you upgrading your game in some way, having more trust, more self-confidence, and with that, you can attract whatever you want. So you are the one who's making a decision what rewards are coming your way. What do you want as a reward? A relationship? New friendship? New partnership? You want financial gain, but be very intentional with what you focus on. Group number two, okay? Let's see anything else. What rewards are coming your way? A new chapter of life is approaching. Yeah, uh, you're going to be pretty happy about this chapter. I'm getting go, go, go type of energy, but it's not that you're exhausted, you're excited. We have K-Pro tonight. Come on, let me kiss that. Oh, I know you missed that. Um, yeah, there is love in the air for sure here. But I'm getting more like flirt, um, dates. Um, it could be an existing partnership already. So leveling up your relationship in some way. Or it could be you meeting a new person. You're very playful with your energy. You're very flirtatious. Um... There are a lot of suitors out there. Let's see what else from the Tilly Tarot. What rewards are coming your way? We have Bridge, successfully overcoming a problem. And I want to put it here because I think it's connected somehow to an, this ending. Uh, what you had to say bye to. A chapter of your life, a particular person, right? A thing. It could be anything. We have moon, changes in your life. We have it twice. A new chapter is approaching, changes in your life. Mm -hmm. And we have a jack, lighthearted, carefree time. Exactly, you're very playful. That's just confirming what I said to you before. You have a lot in that jug to pour from. 
Uh-huh. Yeah, you're very goal-oriented. For sure. Remember how I said be intentional with what you want. Aim for it. Aim for it. We have wedge. Someone is trying to come between you and friend or something you want. I'm getting a bit of jealousy here, but... Um, this is like a piece of cake, <laughs> right? You're going to observe the jealousy, but you're going to take it as a compliment more so than as an insult. <laughs> and we have a crown, yeah. Keeping your head held high here. Honor and respect will come to you, definitely. See, the king of wands person... Would it be male or female, you know, king or queen, doesn't matter. They are very charismatic. They are wanted by many people as partners. Um, would it be romantic? Would it be business partners? Because they're able, with their um, energy, with their drive and their charisma, they're able to accomplish quite a lot. They have a lot of fire in them. They're very passionate. And that's how you're being seen by people around you and therefore there is honor and respect a bit of jealousy you're very goal oriented so don't aim low don't aim for the green area and tell yourself that's gonna be enough for me aim high aim for the center Okay, group number two. I'm going to extend this reading on Patreon. If you want, find me there. I'll see you on the other side. But overall, thanks for spending some time with me here today. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye. Hello, group three. Let's see what rewards are coming your way. Whoever has chosen the golden foil tarot. Let's look. What rewards are coming your way? You have the seven of, seven of Pentacles. I don't know why I heard this with Seven of Pentacles. It never happened before, but I'm getting more time. More time to do the things that you love. Let's see what else. What are you being rewarded for and what does that reward look like mm -hmm. let me clarify these by the way it's quite a slippery deck it's fun to play with Rewards, okay. Mmm, I see you. <laughs> okay. Right, at the bottom we have 10 of cups, 5 of wands, 2 of cups, and the king of wands. And let's look at the bottom of the deck, we have the 2 of pentacles. With this, what I want to say, first thing first, there are a couple of things here. Um, rewards are coming your way. It feels like you're going to be able to win some sort of competition. Now, it could be competing for a job, competing for a specific person even, because I'm seeing that happening here. Competing for something that is that really matters to you. And um, you're the one, if you were struggling for example in relationship area in your life and you said i'm not gonna give up i'm going to keep looking i'm going to keep seeking for such and such partnership you are getting it overall i'm seeing a new relationship here would it be platonic or romantic and maybe it has taken some time to appear in your life but I'm seeing you doing quite a lot of exciting things with this person. So it's not only that this person, this connection is a reward. That's how, how we're going to feel for you at that point in time. But it's also the things that you do together. Mm 
whoever this is, this is a completely new person I'm getting. I don't think you met them at all. It's a fresh breath of air. And it feels like you're meeting this person around a time when you are trying to get something accomplished in your life. Let's see what this is. What are you trying to get accomplished? Mm, again, I keep seeing I want to win in this competition. Let's pull from the steam, steampunk keeper, let's see. In which area of your life are you winning here? Okay, advisor. Getting something signed. Getting something signed. <laughs> Good news for your efforts. Good news for your efforts. I'm seeing documents. I'm seeing maybe you're signing a contract. And say, for example, if you were, um, were competing with other people for a specific uh, property, you are like, uh, no, I'm going to get it. And I'm going to do anything in my power in order to get that particular property. That's just an example. But um, that's what I'm getting with this. Um, I'm not backing away. I'm going to get this. I'm very focused. I'm very driven. And I'm very determined. And I feel like you're meeting this person right around this time when you are on top of your game. What reward is coming your way? Happy, a happy relationship, a very, very happy one. I'm glad The it's very playful. It's very playful. You may want to do things that you have never tried before with this person. Again, romantically, platonically, doesn't matter. Work occupation. Mm -hmm. You may meet this person at their job or through your work, um, through um, a colleague. Or say you walk into a bank and you meet them there. It's something to do with a work setting. Anything else? Yeah, another work and occupation card. <laughs> Anything else? And we have books. Somehow maybe books or documents will be important about this connection it's almost like i'm being shown an environment where you're meeting this person either for work i'm seeing files being stacked up i'm seeing i'm hearing heritage files i don't know what that means to some of you it's like information about a particular object is um is very old there is history to it. There is history in those files. Or transactions that were made in the past. I hope this is making sense. Now let's take these cards back. I want to see what else. So we're seeing a relationship here. We're seeing a new relationship coming into your life as your reward. Let's see why. Why is this reward coming coming in as a person what were you doing in order to attract this reward what were you doing in order to attract this reward what were you doing You know what? The way I'm reading this, you decided not to settle in some way. Yeah, you are you are really patient. You are patient. You knew with a star card what you want. And therefore, um, if you felt like whatever was presented to you in your life, it doesn't match up to what you wanted. You didn't just didn't just take 
um, any opportunity that comes your way. You're ve you are very intentional about what you want and you are patient enough to wait it out because you, your belief was strong enough that you're going to get what you want either way. So trusting in the dream that you had and being patient, your patience is being rewarded. That you didn't just sign up for anything that comes your way. That you were very intentional. I hope this is making sense. Anything that we need to know about this connection? Anything that we need to know about this connection? Okay, what kind? Came out again, the Knight of Cups is here. It's going to be quite a romantic uh, period of your life. This person is bringing romance, sweetness into your life. By the way, whoever this is, they might like sweets very much because it's almost like I can taste it in my mouth. Mm, this person's love language, or one of them at least, is going to be gift given. And they're going to love to surprise you. You don't see it coming, but here I am with a surprise. Or experiences, wanting to do something together. I said together. Here's the lovers. You too. Right? <laughs> um, this person will keep surprising you. Whoever this says, this is someone who's big on surprises. Um, you won't see those coming. It's like you, you got one surprise and then suddenly they turn around there's something else. It can be little things. It doesn't have to be anything um, massive. But they're very giving. They are very giving individual and they're very playful too. Playful in romance in general. Yeah, see, surprise, surprise. Hello. <laughs> they're very sweet. Um, gonna feel like kids together. You'll be playful together. You're gonna laugh a lot. Seeing you leaving little little notes for one another, setting reminders for one another as motivation. Again, you see a very giving individual. We see it with the Six of Pentacles here again. Any advice on this situation? Anything that you need to be advised on here? Explore the fire, your cards are saying. Be playful as well. It seems like playfulness will bring you two together. Like that childlike uh, almost energy. Um, this playful competition over here that we are seeing. And it's going to sound weird, but I'm getting... Um, when you meet this person, don't try to be... Don't try to approach them in a way, if it's a date, if it's a romantic relationship. Don't go on a date and... Um, make it look like an interview be playful don't overthink um show the parts of yourself show your inner child that's what i'm getting i'm going to extend this reading on patreon and if you want to see me on the other side thank you for being here and have a beautiful day or evening bye for now